Hi dear friends, welcome to our channel Infinity Learn Mathematics in a Simple Way. In this video, today we are going to learn how to use the how to use formulas of derivative. Let us try to understand how to use the formulas of derivative. In the first one, we are going to learn how to use derivative of x raised to n. So we are going to learn how to use this one derivative of x raised to n with respect to x is n x raised to n minus one. So this is the formula that we are going to learn how to use this one. So first of all, try to understand if x cube is given, x raised to four is given. Yes. Take the given function as y is equal to y is equal to x cube, y is equal to x raised to four. Here are the two separate problems here. How to use the formula of this one? See here, instead of n, instead of n, what is here? Three. After differentiating, y will become what dy by dx. Differentiate with respect to x. That y will become what here? dy by dx. According to the formula of x raised to n. So n means what here? 3. 3 comes to the what back side? 3x raised to 3 minus 1. That is equal to dy by dx is equal to 3x squared. Because 3 minus 1 is what here? 2. 3x squared. In the same manner, differentiate with respect to x this y will become what dy by dx derivative of x raised to 4 is what 4 4 comes to the what back side x raised to and 1 power will be minus 1 1 will be minus in what 4 minus 1 is what 3 this is what 4x cube let us try to take 5 more examples on this suppose if y is equal to 3x square is given if y is equal to 4x raised to 5 is given. We have to differentiate this one. According to the rules of derivative, differentiate with respect to x. And this one, differentiate with respect to x. Yes, derivative of y will become what here? dy by dx is equal to, uh, this 3 is constant and x square is the function. Here also 4 is constant, x raised to 5 is function. So what we are going to do here, this 3 as it is a derivative of x square is what 2 comes to the what back side, 2x raised to 2 minus 1, 2 minus 1 means what here, 1 itself, dy by dx is equal to 2 minus 1 is what 1, this 3 to the 6, x, because 2 minus 1 is what 1, so uh, this one, see here uh, one more example, differentiate y with respect to x is what dy by dx, this 5 comes here directly we are doing now 5 4 is a 20 x raised to 5 minus 1 is what 4 and derivative of x is 1 that we are not writing yes let us take two more examples on the same type if y is equal to 3x square plus 4x cube plus 5x plus 2 find a dy by dx so we have to differentiate this polynomial here by using the what rules of derivative. So let us try to understand how to solve this one. First take y is equal to 3x square, right? 4x cube plus 5x plus 2. Now differentiate with respect to x this one. On differentiating we get differentiate with respect to x. Derivative of y is what here? dy by dx. Derivative of y is what? dy by dx. This 3 is constant and 3 as it is 2, 3 is a. We are directly doing here 2, 3 is a 6x. 2 minus 1 is what here? 1. We are not writing that one. Plus 3, 4 is a 12. 12x square. Derivative of x is what? 1. x with respect to x is what? 1. Here is also 1. That we are not writing here. Plus y as it is a derivative of this x with respect to x is what? 1. And derivative of 2, 2 is constant, derivative of 2 is what? 0. So last step, dy by dx is equal to 6x plus 12x square into 1, 12x square plus 5 and y. I hope you are clear, you got it. Yes, take one, two more examples of the same type with a negative power. Yes, if y is equal to 4x raised to minus 5 plus 3x square find dy by dx. 
find dy by dx. So let us take solve this one, this problem now. First, write the given thing y is equal to solution of the problem. Y is equal to see here. Here 4 is there, here minus 5 is there. Minus 5 into this plus 4, minus 20. X raised to minus 5, minus 1, because n minus 1 plus 2, 3 is a 6. X raised to 2 minus 1. 2 minus 1 is what? 1. Then derivative of x is what? 1 here. And derivative of x is what here? 1. If you may now, you can write or leave it that 1. Derivative of x is always what? 1. So, this is what dy by dx. So I did the mistake here. Directly differentiate this one. Differentiate with respect to x. The y will what? dy by dx. Derivative of 4x raised to minus 5. 5 4 is 20 because plus into minus is what? Minus 20. X raised to minus 5 minus 1. That is n minus 1. Then derivative of x is what? 1 plus 2 3 is 6. X raised to 2 minus 1 because nx raised to n minus 1. Then derivative of x is what? 1. Now dy by dx is equal to minus 20 x raised to minus 5 minus 1 is what minus 6 into 1 as it is 1 into 20 is what 20 6 into x raised to 2 minus 1 is what 1 that you may write or you can leave yes and 1 into 6 x square x is what 6 x so this is the what we are using the what formula of what x raised to n so let us do the what how to use the derivative of e raised to x for the second formula is what here derivative of e raised to x with respect to x is what e raised to x let us try to understand how to use this formula now if y is equal to e raised to 2x y is equal to e raised to 3x y is equal to e raised to minus 5x y is equal to e raised to minus 7x y is equal to e raised to minus 4x find the dy by dx see here how to use this one derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x e raised to x is what e raised to x here yes here instead of e raised to x 2x is there here 3x is there here minus 5x is there here minus 7x is there here minus 4x is there on differentiating differentiate with respect to x derivative of y is what dy by dx yes derivative of e raised to first of in the first step we are treating the what it is x 2x is what treating x e raised to 2x derivative of e raised to 2x is what e raised to 2x and derivative of x is what 1 1 into 2 2 we are writing back side that is the coefficient of x we have to write in the back side of the e raised to 2x <coughs> differentiate with respect to x this one derivative of y is what dy by dx derivative of e raised to 3x is what 3x derivative of x is what 1 1 into 3 3 we are writing the back side we have to write the always coefficient of x back side or before after the function dy by dx this one derivative of y with respect to x is what dy by dx e raised to minus 5x and write the coefficient of x is what minus 5 back side then dy by dx this one e raised to minus 7x and write the minus 7 back side here yes then dy by dx this one is equal to what e raised to minus 4x into minus 4 so this is the what we are using the e raised to x formula now let us learn one more formula derivative of e raised to x how to use this one derivative of e raised to x with respect to x is e raised to x into log a yes let us how to use this formula now y is equal to 2 raised to x y is equal to 3 raised to x y is equal to 4 raised to x so how to use this formula now let us try to understand a raised to x is what a raised to x into log a on differentiating differentiate with respect to x derivative of y is what dy by dx derivative of a raised to x is what a raised to x into log a here instead of a what is here 2 is there this will become what 2 raised to x into log 2 differentiate with respect to x dy by dx is equal to 
derivative of a raised to x is what a raised to x into log a here instead of a what is here 3 is there a raised to x into log 3 differentiate with respect to x y will become what dy by dx this will become 4 raised to x into log 4 so these are the what derivative of this is the what derivative of x raised to n and derivative of a raised to x and derivative of 2 raised to a raised to x so in the next formula is our next formula is derivative of sin x how to use this one with respect to x is what cos x yes instead of x here we are going to change the what problem here instead of x he will give the what e raised to x e raised to x or log x anything he will be given yes y is equal to sin 2x y is equal to sin e raised to x y is equal to sin root x yes so here this one for this one we have to we must know the what the formula of what derivative of e raised to x is what derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x derivative of root x is what 1 by 2 root x yes here how to differentiate now we are using the what chain differentiation or chain rule we can say till end we have to differentiate because it consists of what sin x differentiate with respect to x this one on differentiating y will become what dy by dx dy by dx derivative of sin is what cos 2x then derivative of this x is what 1 1 into 2 either you can write before or after this 2 the coefficient of x yes this this one differentiate with respect to x derivative of y is what dy by dx derivative of sine then derivative of e raised to x then derivative of x it go it will be going to differentiate three times derivative of sine is what cos e raised to x then derivative of e raised to x is e raised to x derivative of x is what 1 then dy by dx is equal to 1 into cos e raised to x cos e raised to x into e raised to x now this one differentiate with respect to x dy by dx is equal to derivative of sin is what cos root x derivative of root x is the 1 by 2 root x that i am writing directly divided by 2 root x and derivative of x is what 1 yes therefore dy by dx is equal to cos root x divided by 2 root x yes i hope you are getting the points next next to next three we will take the next three problems related to the sign y is equal to sign into the bracket log x y is equal to sign log e raised to x so listen carefully here and observe differentiate with respect to x derivative of sine first this x log x is treated as a x then after that derivative of log x is what 1 by x it is going to be differentiated three times and derivative of x is what 1 so here on differentiating y will become what dy by dx first the derivative of sine is what cos log x then derivative of log x is what 1 by x then derivative of x is what 1 yes this process of differentiation is called chain differentiation we are multiplying till the end of the function yes this one 1 into 1 1 1 into cos log x cos log x divided by x and some students are going to cancel this x it will it is not possible because this x is attached with the what log x yes now come to the what second problem differentiate with respect to x here derivative of y is what dy by dx with respect to x derivative of y with respect to x is what dy by dx derivative of sine is cos log e raised to x as it is derivative of log 1 by x instead of x what is here e raised to x that we are writing e raised to x 
and derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x derivative of x is what one this e raised to x and this e raised to x is going to be cancelled because it is in the what multiplication yes e raised to x in it is on into yes therefore dy by dx is equal to 1 into cos log e raised to x is what cos log e raised to x i hope you are getting the point getting my solutions and getting my explanation next take three more examples on the word sign i is equal to sign root of e raised to x y is equal to sign root of e raised to root x yes differentiate with respect to x this one differentiate with respect to x y will become what here dy by dx derivative of sine derivative of sine is what cos x instead of x what is here root e raised to x derivative of root 1 by root of e raised to x derivative of e raised to x e raised to x derivative of x is what 1 here first it is going to differentiate derivative of sine cos x and derivative of root is what 1 by 2 root x instead of x what is here e raised to x derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x and derivative of x with respect to x is what 1 so it is very easy then simplify it for dy by dx dy by dx is equal to 1 into e raised to x 1 into e raised to x into 1 into this cos e raised to x cos i am writing e raised to x first cos root of e raised to x divided by root of e raised to e raised to x this is the final further it cannot be simplified now come to this one differentiate with respect to x y will become what here dy by dx derivative of sine is what cos root of e raised to root x then derivative of this root 1 by that i am writing directly here divided by 2 root of x that is 2 e raised to root x then derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x instead of x e raised to x what is here e raised to root x then derivative of this root x is what 1 by 2 root of x then derivative of x is what 1 yes now simplify it you will get the what final answer dy by dx is equal to 1 into e raised to root x is what e raised to root x that i am writing first here e raised to root x into cos root of e raised to root x divided by 2 to the 4 into square root of x into e raised to root x is what x e raised to root x this is the final answer hope you are getting the my explanation and how to use the what formulas next let us now come to the what derivative of cos x derivative of cos x derivative of cos x is with respect to x is what minus sin x with this x instead of x he may give the what e raised to x log x e raised to x then root x instead of x he can give the what e raised to x log x e raised to x root x so these formula we know the what how to use these things yes so let us try to understand instead of this x sorry yeah, this x instead of this x he may he may be given to the you people root x uh, e raised to x uh, log x uh, or e raised to x so let us y is equal to cos 2x y is equal to cos 3x yes differentiate with respect to x differentiate with respect to x y will become what dy by dx this derivative of cos is what minus sine instead of x what is here 2x is there 2x and derivative of x is what 1 1 into 2 2 this 2 i am writing back side differentiate 
with respect to x in the same manner as we did the previous problem dy by dx derivative of cos is what minus sin sin 3x and derivative of x is what 1 1 into 3 3 3 we are writing back side yes now let us take five more problems on the what derivative of cos if y is equal to cos e raised to x y is equal to cos root x yes differentiate with respect to x y will become what dy by dx on differentiating y is to what dy by dx derivative of cos minus sine e raised to x instead of x what is here e raised to x and derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x derivative of x is what 1 yes last step simplify it dy by dx is equal to 1 into e raised to x is what e raised to x sine e raised to x it doesn't matter you will write the e raised to x before or after the what sine e raised to x yes differentiate with respect to x y will become what here dy by dx after differentiating y with respect to x derivative of cos is what minus sine root x this derivative of root x is what 1 by 2 root x yes then simplify it dy by dx is equal to 1 into minus sine minus sine root x divided by 2 root x yes so let us take hope you are getting my explanation yes now let us take the what three more problem y is equal to cos log x y is equal to cos log e raised to x yes so on differentiating we get differentiate with respect to x differentiate with respect to x derivative of y is what dy by dx derivative of cos derivative of cos is what minus sin log x in the first step this log x is treated as what x and derivative of log x is what 1 by x then derivative of x is what 1 now dy by dx is equal to 1 into 1 1 1 into minus sine minus sine log x divided by what x now come to here differentiate with respect to x derivative of y is what dy by dx derivative of cos is what minus sine this log e raised to x is what x rate in the first step we are treating this is what x and derivative of log is what 1 by x that is 1 by e raised to x i am writing divided by e raised to x derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x and derivative of x is what 1 e raised to x e raised to x get cancelled and 1 into minus sine that is dy by dx is equal to minus sine log e raised to x so with these problems we come to know that how to use the what formula of x raised to n derivative of x raised to n is what nx raised to n minus 1 and derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x into log a and derivative of root x is what 1 by 2 root x and derivative of log x is what 1 by x and derivative of e raised to x is what e raised to x and derivative of sin x is what cos x and derivative of cos x is what minus sin x so in the next video we are going to learn the what uh, how to use the remaining formulas so hope keep on watching my videos and give please share and subscribe my channel and give the comments for your as i were feedbacks so thank you so much